Hey, Tom from the Mago Kayak School. In this video, I'm going to be talking about kayaking fitness and movement. I will be going over the behind the scenes training to becoming a better kayaker and an overall healthier person. So I'm going to be quickly running over some of the activities and stating why they help. First things first, I would like to recommend getting a back roller if you don't already have one. These are really good for maintaining a healthy spine and you can also use them for other parts of your body like your feet. Yoga, especially hot yoga, is really fantastic for your balance, strength and flexibility. It is also good for your mental strength, meaning mindfulness, concentration, relaxation and other things along those lines. Stretchy bands. These are really good for helping shoulder mobility and strength. Doing these exercises regularly will help prevent shoulder strains or dislocations. You definitely do not want a dislocation. Swimming. If you know that you are a strong swimmer and that you can hold your breath for a long time, you will be able to relax and trust yourself in challenging situations. Swimming is especially important for kayakers, as one way or another you will end up out of your kayak and it could mean the difference in a potentially dangerous situation. Tricking. Tricking is great for your spatial awareness, in essence knowing where your body is while moving. This would relate to if you are free falling while running a waterfall or performing an Eskimo roll. It is also a super good way to learn new things and push yourself out of your comfort zone. Jumping. The same with tricking it will help you know where your body is in flight. Eskimo rolling. All movements, no matter how good you are, need to be constantly practiced. Always keep practicing your roll. Don't get comfortable with just rolling on one side. You want to be able to roll from whatever position you find yourself in upside down. I suppose that the conclusion is, doing the boring stuff means that you're going to have more fun in the long run. For a more in-depth explanation, please read the blog post. I'd like to say thank you for watching this video. I hope that you learned something new. If you have any questions or queries, do not hesitate to email me or give me a call. Give us a like on Facebook, follow us on Instagram, and hope to see you on the water.